Uh, it's important to uh, point out that case numbers are rising across the UK just now, but after a period of slower increases in Scotland, the rise here is particularly sharp at the moment. That is possibly, at least in part, a reflection of the fact that our schools return earlier uh, with the increased interactions that come with that. And we know, of course, uh, that the measures which have been in place for much of the last 17 months have in themselves caused serious harm. They've disrupted schools, hurt the economy, affected well-being. That's why, even although if we are being responsible, which we must be, we can't and shouldn't rule anything out in the face of a pandemic. None of us want to go backwards uh, to even limited restrictions. Of course, we can't ignore the current surge in cases either. Uh, my job in times like these is not to be popular, it's to take any decisions, no matter how difficult, that are necessary to keep us safe, and I will uh, certainly not hesitate to do that. Uh, in particular, we are currently watching closely to see whether and to what extent we might start to see significant increase in serious illness and obviously in people uh, being hospitalised. So I will continue to keep you updated in the days ahead, but it's worth being clear uh, right now with you uh, that some of the speculation you might be reading in the media uh, is not accurate. For example, we are not currently considering a circuit breaker uh, lockdown.